Welcome back to, I guess, another season of What I Did in Lab Today, where I tell you guys what I did in Biochem Lab today. So today was our first half of our plant propagation lab, where we're basically taking some plant tissue, in this case I think it's mint, and we are taking just tiny bits of that tissue and growing new plants out of it. Now, this was the first half of the lab, so all we were doing today was preparing the growth medium. So we had two different media that we were supposed to make. One was a rooting medium, and one was a regeneration medium. So they were for regenerating plant tissue, and then for growing roots. So we had two different media with two different solutions. Now the procedure for both was the same, the only difference was the type of hormone mix that we added to the media to help with the different things that the different media was supposed to do, root or regeneration. So what we had to do was just take a big beaker full of water, add some sucrose, add a salts mixture for nutrients and stuff, and add some vitamins. Then we had to stir that bad boy, but our stir bar was not behaving, and that drove my lab partner absolutely nuts. So after all the solids were dissolved, we added some gel stuff. It's basically a powder that when added to water, it will turn it into a gel, which makes it good for plating things. So once all of the ingredients for the two different media were mixed up, we put them in those autoclave bottles and then autoclaved them for 40 minutes. Basically what autoclaving does is a sterilization technique. It's basically using high pressure and high temperature steam to kill any contaminants such as fungal or bacterial cells that could get in the media and cause problems because it wants to grow there as well. And we don't want fungus or bacteria to grow there, we want plants to grow there. So after getting all of that autoclaved, all the contaminants removed, then we had to let it cool for a bit because again, it's very high temperature so it's very hot. Then when we were done, we had to put the different media into the different containers. The rooting media went in, there are these up there, baby food bottles technically, and the regeneration media went into these flat petri dishes. We had to use the sterile technique to make sure again there's no contaminants that got in after we autoclaved it because we auto already autoclaved everything, so we don't want any contaminants to get in because we can't autoclave these again. So we have to have the Bunsen burner with the flame, we have to use ethanol to rub down the whole counter thing and do our very best to make sure no bacteria or fungal cells get onto the plates. Then we let them cool and solidify and then put them away to store for next lab where we'll be actually... Well, actually my lab partner's not going to be here next week, so I will be rooting our plants and starting them off to grow in the new growth media. 